Hey what's going on guys, today I'm going to show you how to change the login URL of your WordPress website. By default in WordPress your login URL is your domain name.com slash wplogin.php or you can also access it by going to your domain name.com slash wpadmin. But unless your site is a membership website, this URL should only be used for administrational purposes like creating a new post or changing your website themes. So it's always better to hide your login page from unwanted people by changing your login page URL. After watching this tutorial, you can customize the login URL to any URL you want. So without further ado, let's get started. Here first of all we need to install a new plugin. So let's go to add new plugin. And here I search for WPS hide login. Let's install this one and then activate. Okay, after activating from here, let's go to settings or you can also go from this WP height login option. So here, this is the option for your custom login URL. You can customize this to any URL you want. But here, I don't recommend you to use this kind of easy URL like login, sign in or my login. So here I want to set the URL of the login page to login 3044. So in this way, I make the login URL more difficult, which is very hard to guess. And I also can easily remember this login page URL. You can use any kind of name you want, but I would like to give this kind of name. Okay, then this is the redirect URL. So this URL is the URL when someone goes to wblogin.php or trying to access the login page by going to WP admin. Here I want to redirect them to 404 page. So I keep the default option 404. But you can set it to any specific page and set the pages slack here. Okay, now click on save changes. And now let's log out from our dashboard. Okay, now let's try to go slash WP admin. Here it redirect us to this 404 page and if we also try to go to slash wplogin.php Okay, you can see this also failed to go to our login page. Now we can only access our login page by only going to this specific URL which is login 3044. Here I also recommend you to use a strong username and password for your login. So in case someone get access to your custom login URL, they are not able to go into your dashboard if you set a strong password. And I recommend you to make the password to combine with letter, character and digits and make it more lengthy to make it more secure. Ok, now let's log into our dashboard. Ok, you can see we can successfully log into our dashboard with our custom login URL. So that's how we can change your login URL on your WordPress website. If you enjoyed this, then don't forget to like this video and subscribe to my channel to inspire me to make more videos like this. Thank you so much. I'll see you on my next.